The lecturer said they couldn't understand why the school management has allegedly spent $8.4 million on official vehicles for themselves. When the school is struggling with an ill-equipped library and inadequate teaching and learning materials. In order for us to have a standard university that actually responds to the needs of the government society, we need certain material facilities and the human base, standard human base to underpin the role of the university in the national development. I don't even think there is a need to buy those vehicles because our toilet conditions, I really think um, the money could have been utilized judiciously by um, up upgrading UTG toilet facilities. It's really deplorable and it's really appalling if you visit these toilets. Visi himself came to visit one of the toilets there. He could not spend a minute there. He had to go back um, because of the odor uh, that were emanating from the toilet. The students were also not pleased with the authorities and described the spending as misplaced priorities. In a bid to verify the claims, Gambia Radio and Television Services inspected the toilets and classrooms to find out if the claims are true. This is a university where students you know, struggle to get seats to have their classes. This is a university that in fact students had to struggle to get classrooms to conduct lectures. Lecturers you know, do not have enough you know, teaching um, materials to conduct their lectures and so many other problems and wherein staff can be here for more than you know, a decade without being trained by the university. This university is coming close to 20 years now and still now you know, we are at this stage. You know, so if the authorities do not have uh, any other thing you know, to think of you know, other than you know, to buy luxurious cars you know, for themselves, uh, it only shows that you know they are not here for the interest of the students and in fact they are not here to serve the nation rather they are serving their self interests if you look at the science department of the university of the gambia for so many years now they have not had any practicals anytime you know the students complain you know they ask for materials they say you know we don't have you know funds yet the internet, you know, connectivity is not there. From Brikama, we drove to the office of the Vice Chancellor and other senior officials to hear their side of the story. Improvement of the facilities, we provided 337,000 Delsi to the Gambia College, only to improve the sanitation facilities. There are three salon cars and three um, four wheel. The three salon cars are about 800,000. The four wheel, which is about 1.1, 1.2 million. Within these four months, we have engaged Gamtel that they are going to put fiber throughout this campus all the way to a Virkama campus. This is the first major conflict involving the administration and staff at the university regarding the purchase of vehicles. Many people may be keenly watching how and when this conflict will be resolved. Reporting for GRTS News, I am Aisa Tujata.